it on for Southern Star. It wasn't as great as I expected though. Oh, I thought you had the cocktail. Oh. So Can't believe this. Dude, what's wrong? Jack, what's wrong? We're all screwed. Why are we screwed, Jack? What did you do? I didn't do anything, that's the problem. I don't know about you guys, but I'm about to lose my shit. What's happening? We have an exam coming up. But that's not in another two months. No, it's in another two weeks. Wait, what? No one told us this. I knew this was gonna happen. You knew this was gonna happen and you didn't even tell us? You knew and you didn't say anything? Jack, I just didn't want you guys to walk. <laughs> I did it for you, Jack! I did it for you! I didn't mean any of what I did or said that day. I was just so confused as to why he would keep something like that from our group. It had been a week since Ross and I last spoke. We had study sessions every day that week, working hours on end. I didn't say anything at first. I, I had a practice sack. I wanted to prove myself that I could do it on my own. The pressure got to me. What happened? I choked. I'm useless. There's no way I'm gonna pass this exam. Why'd you leave the classroom? I left because I just, I had a panic attack. I had a practice sack and I just like, I had to get out of there. Why didn't you tell me? I would've helped you. I didn't want to say anything because I wanted to surprise you guys, to make you guys proud, to show you that I could do it on my own. To show, like, to show you that I've worked hard and that I just... You don't have to prove anything. I've seen you all year. You've been working really hard. We all have. Thanks, man. I knew then and there that there was always someone there for me and that I just had to ask for help. It was hard to believe that only two weeks from now, my entire life was going to change. You ready to do? I don't think it'll possibly be any more ready. Good, because you got this. Yeah. Alright. Hours ticked by to what felt like an eternity. This was it. This one A4 sheet of paper is going to determine my entire future. That's what terrifies me the most. Stuff. How'd you go? I think I did pretty well. Hopefully I get what I need. That's good to hear. Well, we find out in a week, I guess, so start applying for some universities. You have nothing to worry about. My brother approached me while I was in my room. He said a letter had come for me. It was from VCAR. I typed as fast as my thumbs could move to let everyone know to get to my house as soon as possible. I wanted them all there when I opened that envelope. You guys were all a massive part of it, and I wanted to bring these all together um, to see me open it. No matter what happens, I love you all. I passed. Work something out. That's okay. I knew this was gonna happen. Um, we just have to make the most of every moment we have together. And just live it like it's our last. Salute. Salute, mia familia. Salute. Salute. Well, that's it, I guess. Our future's been set. It's only gonna get better. If you ask me what I learned in my 12 years of school, I would tell you that it's not like everyone says it is. It's, it's so much better. Yeah, it has its ups and downs. But in the process, you meet some really amazing people. I would also say to you, to utilise. To speak up. Because that's what friends, family, teachers, that's what they're there for. And last, but definitely not least, friends are always there for you. The family is forever. Using me up.